What's up, everybody? Man, it's your boy, Mr. Duga, coming at y'all with another video, man. Yes, baby. <clears throat> That's what I'm talking about, yo. And today, I'm going to talk about today's baseball game. You had the Atlanta Braves beating the Los Angeles Dodgers 5-3 to three to take two out of three in this series, this critical series versus the Dodgers, yo. Big, big time series win, man, especially how like Friday night's game got away from us. Love how this team fought hard. Love how this team responded. And also considering the fact, you know, we missing guys like Swanson, you know, um, Riley, Mar Marquecas, you know, and, <clears throat> and Acuna for over half of this game, which I'll get to that a little later. But, um... Yeah, man, Max Free came out first and man, he was getting hit up pretty hard, yo. Um, got very unfortunate as Bellinger hit the ball to center field. And Acuna had it in his glove and it bounced out his glove. And the Dodgers went up 3 nothing, and guys just getting on. And then it's like, okay, this may be like a Turan performance, you know, he had against the Mets his last time out. Uh, and it looked like it's just not our day today. But... You know, after that first inning, after the first couple of guys in the second inning got on, got a double play to get out of that inning. Shout out to Freed, man. He gathered himself. He um he had he wrote the ship, and he didn't give him no more runs. And uh, offensively, you know, we kind of didn't fully have it today. But you know, Hatcher, Rara, whatever his name is, <laughs> I can't pronounce his name. The new shortstop we got, man. He's been playing. He played great this series, offensively and defensively. He gets an RBI in, man, to cut it to 3-1. to one. Then, um, you know, Acuna gets pulled in the game for not hustling on a home run, which I'll get to that a little later. But then later on in the game, man, Ortega, who we just pretty much called up, goes up there with the bases loaded, man, and hits a grand slam, yo. Wow. <laughs> what, a, what a hit, man. What a shot, man. Knock it clean out of the park. Gave us a 5-3 to three lead. And once again, for the second straight game, after this just blow up Friday night, the pull, the bullpen steps up huge again and close out the game. This time, didn't even give the Dodgers a run, only gave up one hit, I want to say. They held it down, man. Chris, and now three new additions went out there, held it down. Chris Allen held it down. Um, You know, Shane Green held it down, and Mark Melanson closed it off, yo. Big time win, big time series win. It's it's a good time to be a Braves fan right now, man. You got to love it. it. It lets you know that, you know, maybe we can play with this team a little bit if we, if we got to play them in the NLCS series or if, we if you know, we both get to that point. And hopefully this is the start of the bullpen really getting their swagger, you know. Um, you can see that the potential is there. They just got to get it out of their head and go out there and put it together and execute pitches. And that's what they've done last night and today, yo. And if they could perform like that, man, with the lineup we'll have after we get guys healthy, you know, the skies could be the limit for this team, yo. Um, Now, real quick before I get out of here, I'll get on the Acuna situation, man. Obviously, it was um his second at bat, I want to see, where he hit a ball where it, it looked like it could have been a home run, but it actually hit off the wall. And he was pretty much admiring the hit, so he didn't really run at all. And it ended up being just a single. And at the point of the game, you know, he also tried to steal second and got thrown out. So it was a big, you know, kind of momentum killer play. You know, it's something that we can't have happen. But quite honestly, man, I think, in my opinion, now, granted, it worked out <laughs> at the end of the day. All is well. We got the win. So all is well. But at the time it happened, man, I didn't, I thought Snit overreacted a little bit, yo. Um, now, if more come out of it that maybe Acuna told him something back, got, you know, smart mouth with him or whatever, I don't know. You know, maybe that'll come out later if that happened. But if it was just a situation where, you know, Snit pulled him out for that play, I felt like it was a little bit of an overreaction, man. Um... When you consider the fact that, you know, this guy plays hard, man. You know, he he's out there. He's diving all over the place. You know, he's hitting the ball. He's stealing bases. He's playing every day. He's durable. I mean, he's 21 years old. Obviously, hey, it's a boneheaded play, yo. It's a play you can't have happen. 
but I feel like you just pull him to the side, you tell him, hey, you go out there and you hustle. I think him getting pulled out of the game just was a little bit much, yo. Then when you consider the fact, not just that, bruh, you got a lot of little kids and you got a lot of people who may don't get a chance to really see the Braves every game in person. You know, you got a lot of people at that ballpark that went over there to see Acuna play, yo. Now, if it was a situation where this is something that always happened, like he just constantly kept doing this and costing us doubles and getting singles instead, then, yeah, you make a statement and you sit him down a game before a game starts, in my opinion. You know, you, you sit him down the following game. In a big game like this, man, the, a, packed, a packed house like that, the fact that people went out there to see him play, I feel like you don't pull him out of that game for that situation. Now, granted, it worked out. We got the W, and maybe this got through the Acuna that, hey, you know, you don't do this again. But I just felt like it was too risky of a move, not only for the team to try to win the game, but for the people who paid their hard-earned money to go out there and see Ronald Acuna play ball. You know, so that's just my take on it, man. I know some people may agree, may disagree. But at the end of the day, we all can agree this was a big-time series win versus the Dodgers, yo. And it feels good to be a Brave fan right now. Just got to keep this momentum going, and this bullpen has to stay consistent, yo. But, um, but with that being said, man, that's all I got for y'all today. Appreciate y'all checking out the video. Go on, hit the like button for your boy, and give me a subscribe. I'm going to have Atlanta Braves content throughout the year. Also, on Tuesday at 4 p.m. Central, I will do a live Q&A Come on, ask me what you want to ask me. I'll answer your questions and give you a shout out. Y'all have a blessed one. Chop on.